calligraphy has existed in pretty much every culture for years. So European, Arabs, um, every single Asian country has their own form of calligraphy. And over time, as things mixed, um, the way that it happened mixed. Like, so for instance, in European cultures, it was very, very big to use pointed pen or like a straight edge pen. But um, in Asian cultures, it was often used a brush pen. So calligraphy now, often there's two types of it. Pointed pen is still used, but there's also with English uh, calligraphers, what's called like modern calligraphy, which uses a brush pen to do calligraphy. So today, because calligraphy isn't as popular as it once was, there just isn't the same resources or time put into its manufacturing. So if you are someone that, say, practices point, pointed pen, pointed pen isn't as in use, so the tools used for it aren't as refined. Actually, you can't get pointed pen nibs as refined as you could back in, like, um, in the beginning of the 20th century. And pointed pen nibs that it still exist from that era are actually incredibly coveted and looked for. So calligraphy is important because at its core it's an art form and we still need to value art and you know there's a lot of it that goes into industry and stuff like that but there's still a lot of beauty into it and like anything it's a great creative outlet for anyone that needs that. Mm -hmm.